You said earlier on that um, Frank and Patrick were thrilled for you, that you won the World Championship in 96. How did they break the news that, <laughs> so thrilled, but actually, well, it's all coming to an end? Uh, they didn't. It was in autosport as I turned up for the German Grand Prix. Was that really the first? You read it in the media first. I had had um, a little bird tell me something about um, the possibility that I'd lost my drive in at the beginning of the season, I think. And I kind of dismissed it. Did you um, approach? Did you ask Frank? I asked Patrick and he assured me it was nonsense. <laughs> um, and I think that was in Aida. So that was that. I don't know why I think it was there. But anyway, uh, muddled. I, I can't remember exactly. But anyway, I, I the, really the first time I'd ever heard anything uh, that, that I, you know, basically the, the, the autosport front cover was on the table as I came into the motome at, uh, uh, in the German Grand Prix in 96. And it says, William Sachs Hill. Damon, what happens next in, in that little... Well, I got very cross with Andrew Benson, who wrote the, the article. But, um, you know, you can't shoot the messenger. He was just writing what he knew. And he wouldn't say who it was who told him. But the, um, I, I mean, the understanding I have now is that the, the I'd lost my drive by, I suppose, because of my performances in 95. Um, but then why would you sign me for 96? Because I only ever had a one-year contract. When did they sign you for 96? Oh. I mean, was it a November would have been time? Middle of, I think it would have been, yeah, it would have been middle of 95 sometime. So... In fact, if it was at Silverstone, it would have been just before I crashed into Michael Schumacher for the <laughs> umpteenth time. So, um, yeah, I still was in with a shout. So I, but I think that they, the feeling is that they knew they had signed, if they were going to keep me, they, they just, they'd have to put three cars on the grid for 97. So uh, it turns out they might have got themselves in a bit of a pickle. Um, uh, an embarrassment of riches, so to speak. And despite perhaps wanting to keep me, ideally, they couldn't because they had another driver already under contract and they weren't going to let go of that contract. So I had, I was the one that was given the option of saying. So did you, yeah. um, did you think of quitting? Well, my, my winning average was fantastic. So I was right up there with Jim Clark, I think. <laughs> and, um, and so it might have been a good time to stop. But then there was so much more to You didn't to do. seriously think of that? and No, not seriously, no. no. So what were the options on the table for 97? Well, you went a very at... short career, wouldn't it? I and mean, that was three seasons, <laughs> I think. I mean, for <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, I think I still had a few more races in me. Yeah.